Hi right, guys, so here we are at about to go into November. So this this for this video, I'll be going over the November spread that I've set up for the coming month. Very simple again. Um, change the font up. Little November right here. It's kind of I this font is like um, I focus on like some big nice just curvy letters. Um, not curvy, but like. More like bulby letters, like, and then with round edges. And then here I kind of experimented with um, using some black and then using just a white pen, simple white pen, pen um, and just going over Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday on the black. And here, the days of the month. Very simple. Here, um, switch to all lowercase right here, all, but one, uh, about the same font. All round, a lot of rounded edges. Just a little quick Thanksgiving turkey right there, in which in a, the next one of the next videos I will show, in which you can follow, um, which will be full of all these Thanksgiving doodles, in which you can fill up any empty space that you have, like in the previous month. Um, here we go with a very simple chart. Um, the highlighting option here is, of course, optional. Um, and again, in the alternate videos, I will I'll be doing another alternate video in which I will be showing alternative formats in which you can do um, things like these small little titles, and then have the notes section down here, and then here. Um, we, once again, we have a sleep tracker carrying over all these fonts over here. Um, the hours and the days of the month down, going down. Very simple again. Same style as the other ones that I've done. Here you have the mood tracker. I kind of change this up a little bit. Um, instead of doing the squares, um, um, I kind of rounded the edges so it goes with the kind of like this font all rounded. Um, I will be splitting these in half to do once again the positive negative and meh. Um, same as before. Positive, of course, being. Let me just fill this in really quick. Up. Meh. And the negative. And then, for example, the lines going through. Just mostly, mostly the same as before, but just with these all with the rounded edges. Habit tracker. Um, I changed this up a bit because I wanted to be able to add a bit more stuff. In the past, I just did um, an exercise tracker. So, and now I've changed it to a lot more things. Um, a full habit tracker here, section for it. Um, I did the, the nice little grid for every single day of the month um, and yay or nay once again yay or nay and yeah I added one for exercise I will push myself with continue with exercise really start working on my guitar journaling um, skincare and getting my vitamins and YouTube since I just started YouTube very recently I want to keep track of the days that I work on my videos and here again we go with the, uh, my songs page and my brain dump page very simple again seems um, this is gonna be just again in the future it'll just be the I will be doing the same format of bullet points and down the page. Yep, so we have just a couple of little song doodles here, just the very big following with this font um, of some notes. And here I change it to those notes down the page. And yep. And here we are at the week section. Um, take this off. And 
here continuing the lowercase font and carrying it through it's the same kind of font all in lower caps lowercase for the days of the week very simple following with the Friday Saturday because that's how the month starts the first week is just Friday Saturday and then continuing down the page leaving a lot of page for notes and of course a lot of blank space in which you can fill up with doodles in the future um, if you would like and which I'll be again be showing in one of my next videos and of course um, just like in my previous spreads um, for me I don't have that much going on so I tend to just use one page and for the whole week but of course if you do have a lot more activities and events you can always spread this into two pages and just expand each section to however much you need to locate for each day and yeah there we go that's my November spread and here of course you have I'm already working on the next spread uh, for December so that's a little sneak peek right there and if you enjoy this video please like and subscribe it's very simple minimalist bullet journal style anybody can do it And yeah, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.